Yo, yo, what's good, everyone? Welcome to my channel. I am a sage who rises today. I will be doing the sun, moon rising of Scorpio. So let's get to it. So, angels, so Scorpio, we got imprisonment in the reverse. Okay, so you're not in your head at all. And it's because you got some type of receipts here. You got some type of proof, evidence. You got some type of facts. And at the bottom of the deck, we got courthouse again. You got some type of facts here on the path that somebody chose. And what they was expecting for you, main female. I'm saying that somebody possibly tried to take something from you, a partnership. And they was doing work behind the scenes. Now, they're surprised. Because whoever this older male is, they thought that he was going to get some type of sudden wealth. But something is changing for this person. And it's because of the work that they did behind the scenes with other people on your journey. And it's like the journey that you was on is the reason why you are seen as high honor. And you got some type of proof, receipts on the journey that somebody chose here. Mm-hmm. And this is why you're coming out of your head. Because you got proof. You got receipts. You got Comet Masculine. Not your homie. Will pop your ass if you let him close to you. Hmm. We got trust no one at this time. Justice will be served. We have, they're trying to get those spirits off their ass. Alright. So let's see what's going on. Because as I cut it, we have, you're too strong for these three by three witches. So you could be dealing with sisters. Hmm. You could be dealing with an occult. But, um, yeah. You got a karmic masculine here. And three witches. So why is karmic masculine not your homie? Yeah. With the three of cups coming out in the reverse. This is somebody that is very disloyal. And yes, they will betray you. Mm -hmm. Nine of Pentacles in reverse. This is somebody that is facing setbacks. Could be in poverty. This is somebody who is wanting rewards without putting the work in. This is somebody who also has bad faith. And then we have the Three of Pentacles. So we got a group of mediocre ass bitches who work together. And they're very sloppy. We got some type of group conflict that's going on. Remember I told you three by three witches. We got three people here and three people here. These motherfuckers work together, but it was a sloppy ass fucking job. It's giving low quality and mediocre. <laughs> they have a lack of skill. And they're, they're, they're just sloppy. Like, it's just that simple. Like, what? Two of pinnacles. I'm saying that um, you were able to balance out a situation and adopt to a situation, period, with this two of pentacles. But you have a family here with the ten of pentacles, queen of swords. That you're being told to cut the fuck off, turn your back on, not of pentacles. Because they're trying to strategically, or oh, I mean, hold on, methodically slow you up for a pentacles. This is how they think that they're going to get control of a situation. Eight of wands with projecting tower. Some type of upheaval, mm -hmm, some type of adversity and with the ace of swords that's the fucking truth you're being seen as the empress nine of cups i'm also saying that this could be a mother figure's wish fulfillment a queen of wands this is why they're so invested uh-huh knight of swords and taking this impulsive ass action but with the two of swords what they don't see coming is whoever this queen of cups is that took some type of action when it came to your love life with a king of pentacles there's about to be an end of a karmic cycle because you've already transformed and you've already ended some type of cycle. Six of Cups with these past people, Six of Pentacles that has been trying to break from you. Eight of Pentacles, this could also be bitches who tried to take, you know, your work. The Six of Pentacles with the Eight of Pentacles is somebody who is basically trying to make a scene like whatever work you put in, that was their work. Mm-hmm. Why is they're trying to get those spirits off their ass? Why is this here? For Scorpio. Yeah, Six of Pentacles, Two of Swords. This could be a Taurus, a Libra. 
This is somebody who wanted you to share your success with them. Two of swords. Mm -hmm. But you're being told to listen to your inner voice when making this choice. Mm -hmm. Six of cups. This is somebody from your past. Either your sister, your brother, your cousin, your aunt. This can even be your mother. This can even be an old school friend with that six of cups. With the death card, something is about to come to an end. Will of fortune. It's an ending to some type of karmic cycle that you have with the king of pentacles. It's just that simple. But yeah. Why is trust no one at this time? Why is this here for Scorpio? Yeah. Three of pentacles coming out in the reverse again. You got a group of low quality, having ass, mediocre ass bitches that has no skill. <laughs> and they're trying to cause a group conflict because of their sloppiness. Now the pentacles in reverse. Like I said, these are bitches who have bad faith and they wanted some type of reward without putting in the word. Three of cups in reverse again. These are bitches who are your ops. They are very disloyal and they want you to go through, the, through some type of rejection or betrayal. Queen of cups. Knight of wands. So you could be dealing with a cancer. Feminine. This person took some type of impulsive ass action to lie on you to a queen of pentacles. So this ain't even got to be a cancer. This is somebody who wanted to betray you. This is somebody who was disloyal to you. A queen of cups. This could be a Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. Knight of Wands, who took an impulsive ass action. Seven of Swords, to be dishonest, to try to strategically betray you because of low self-esteem. You got a queen of pentacles here that's about to go through a change. This could be a Virgo with a masculine. And it's because this person thought they was going to receive some good news with a king of wands. But they're under fucking judgment. And now they're frustrated. Because they got some type of disaster coming in with a Taurus. Who they moved on to common waters with just to cause conflict for you. Um, uh -huh. The six of swords to the five of wands to the tower. Something is about to backfire. And with the eight of wands, it's going to hit the exact target. It's going to hit this group. The eight of wands is going to the tower to the five of wands to the six of swords. As you move on. From this Taurus and this Sagittarius, there is, uh, they are under fucking judgment. Definitely this King of Wands who thought they was going to receive some good news. Mm-mm-mm. Four of Pentacles tried to hold you back. Seven of Cups with an illusion. Three of Swords just to call you pain and suffering. But that's the bitter truth. Three of Wands. But in the distant horizon, Ace of Pentacles, you will be receiving some type of prosperity. Some type of opportunity that you manifested. Seven of Pentacles, you will be receiving the results of your labor. You know? This is your hard work paying off. This is your karmic justice with the justice card. And with the nine of swords, somebody is going through anxiety. Weary. Feeling like the victim. Sun card because they're going to be exposed. Oh, well. Why is justice will be served? Yeah. They go to justice. It's your will. Seven of pentacles. Somebody is about to reap what the fuck they sow. Ace of pentacles because they did it for money. Yep. We got the seven of cups. Somebody was literally out here creating illusions. And an illusion. Three of swords thinking that it can cause you pain and suffering. Three of wands. This is somebody at a distance from you. Either an Aries or this could be a king of cups. A Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces masculine. Five of cups that's in hell of regret. Magician for doing this magic. The moon, some type of illusion magic. Two of wands because the path they chose. Death card only ended things for them. Six of cups in the past. Two of swords. This person did not see this coming. Six of pentacles that... Them bread from you? <laughs> the world only close out a karmic cycle for them. So them trying to take something from you and give it to somebody else only close out a cycle for them. Like, period. Them bread from you, them giving to you and someone else, it's just fuck them up at the end. Why is you too strong for these three by three witches? You sure is. Nine of cups, they keep trying to come towards you. Two of cups, possibly you and your partner. Five of pentacles to cause y'all poverty. So you got a group of three by three witches that's trying to invite y'all places. But these are bitches that are very moody and vain. And they cause they stuff coming towards you and your partner. To cause y'all to be insecure. To cause y'all hardship and poverty. They want y'all to lose money and they want y'all to lose y'all position. Mm -hmm. But what's going to happen for them? Hmm. Three of cups in reverse. Again, you got a bunch of... <laughs> This is a bunch of disloyal ass people. With the three of cups, this could be a group of people that is very disloyal. And they wanted you to go through rejection. 
But with the Ten of Wands, something was too hard for them to do. Plus this Queen of Cups, Knight of Wands, took up impulsive ass action. Seven of Swords to lie on you. Uh, to a Queen of Pentacles. And now they're getting fucking karma. This Queen of Pentacles and this Queen of Cups is getting karma. For trying to strategically betray you. Hey. People just don't learn their lessons, y'all. But at the same time, that ain't, that ain't our business. To be worried about. What the fuck they are trying to plot. Because at the end of the day, you control your fucking life. <laughs> it doesn't matter what the people think. It doesn't matter what the people say. You know? And yeah, um, I've been getting messages like, oh, do you really talk like that? First of all, I hate to sound like a kid. So yes, I put a little bass in my voice because I don't want nobody to be distracted by how I really talk. Okay? Focus on the message, not my voice. Thank you. So what we got for Scorpio? Yeah, you too busy winning, okay? You too busy winning to be worried about these fake smiling ass bitches that's being rejected and going through legal issues. Why is too busy winning here? Yeah, you too busy winning to be worried about a played out bitch that's holding a grudge. So something that's played out, whatever this grudge holder is trying to do, they're only doing this shit because they are a spiritual hater. It's just that simple. Why is fake smiles here? For Scorpio. Yeah, you got a bitch that's fake smiling in your face, trying to act as though they happy for you. But they're not. This is somebody that's clout hungry, that's trying to dirt dig on you. This could be possibly somebody like, oh, she got third parties. They got multiple lovers. They got choices. But they only mad because you moved on. I'm also hearing, this is, this is a dramatic ass bitch that's making shit up. Okay? Trying to say you got multiple lovers. This is somebody that you didn't move away from. Okay, that's wanting to come towards you with an offer, but what an offer, whatever an offer that they have, this offer that they have, this is just a part of their chess ass game. Yeah, this is a drama starter. They ain't got no fucking offers. They only want to play mind games and start drama. Yeah, you're being told to reject a thief and remain unbothered because this bitch ain't never got the facts. Just trying to force their way in and force shit to be what it is. This could also be somebody that's just trying to force what they want. Why is legal issues here for Scorpio? Like I said, somebody is going through court issues. Okay? But got the nerd to be trying to get the inside scoop on you. This a bitch that's always partying. This body fake flexing. Trying to debonate abuse on you. Just so that they can cop block. This is a bitch that you need to ignore. Who is this person anyway? Who is this cop blocker that Scorpio needs to ignore? Who is this? A Virgo. Yup, with that Eight of Pentacles. Look, Queen of Pentacles. Eight of Pentacles. This is a Virgo. You need to block this person to fuck out your fucking life right now. Yup. Will of Fortune. Yeah, this bitch gonna get karma. Look, it's a Virgo. The Eight of Pentacles is Virgo. The Queen of Pentacles is a Virgo, Taurus, or Capricorn. This is a Virgo. This bitch is gonna get karma. Hermit for what they did in secret. The Hermit is also Virgo. This is a fucking Virgo. And they're played the fuck out. They're played the fuck out. I don't know how many times I gotta keep saying that shit in every message. Like, bitch, you're played out. Yeah, this is somebody who thought they was gonna get a blessing. This is a bitch who was optimistic about a look. This bitch had the nerve to be sitting with her feet up, knowing that whatever the fuck she was thinking was a fucking illusion. Thinking that she gonna get a blessing off of a fucking illusion that she knew was an illusion. Or he knew was an illusion. It came up, it's the queen of pentacles, so they're seeing him as a bitch if it's a dude. What we got going? Yeah, somebody was out here doing magic on you. Mm -hmm. Doing motherfucking magic for gain. But you still out here relaxing. And they out here feeling overloaded, overwhelmed. Because they created all this bullshit. <laughs> doing magic. It's a, to keep up some type of illusion that they was daydreaming about. Now they need your help and aid. Because they were out here trying to protest, trying to put some type of unwanted attention on you. And it's because of some type of connection you was in. Yeah. This person did not know that you was of alliance with whoever you're with. So, like, it's, it, it's giving bitches is too pressed about what you got going on in your love life. Like, bitch, what about you? And if this is your dude's people, like, the bitch is too pressed. And if it's your people, the bitch is too pressed. Whoever it is, they, they pressed. They too pressed. To the point that it's like, yo. 
Worry about your life, who? Yeah, Knight of Swords. Hangman. Somebody took an impulsive ass action without getting all the facts. Just so that they can sabotage you. Mm-mm-mm. <laughs> Could have been a Gemini. Could have been a Pisces. It doesn't even fucking matter. What we got going for school? Yeah. Justice. You are about to receive karmic justice. Three of Cups when it comes to this group of bitches who was working together. Celebrating. Six of Pentacles. Taking something from you. Eight of Cups. Like I said in the beginning. Whoever these bitches is. <laughs> they are going to have to abandon their plans. Whatever the fuck they came up with. Look. Eight of Cups. Page of Wands. Knight of Swords. They got to walk away because you already are being seen as an inspiration. You already out here. You're seen already. <laughs> Knight of Swords. Like I said, it was an impulsive ass action to take towards somebody that's already seen. Why is justice here? Yeah. Somebody is getting karma for taking an impulsive ass action. Five of Swords to play mind games with you. This is somebody who wanted to win at all costs. But with the chariot, you got victory and success over this demonic ass energy that was supposed to be playing in your life. Two of Pentacles, you was able to bounce back four of swords and lay some shit to rest. Or you're being told to, you're being told to, you're being told that you're going to get karma justice for this Sagittarius taking an impulsive ass action. Five of swords to play mind games with you and your person or with you and another person. You could be dealing with a cancer with the chariot. Yeah, they thought they could play mind games with a cancer. Double, a toxic ass couple, two of pentacles that you already didn't bounce back from, four of swords and laid some shit to rest with. Nine of cups, keep trying to invite you places. Ace of swords, knowing that you know the truth, five of wands about these people being envious and jealous of you. You already know the truth that you, it's a group of, uh, a group or a community of motherfuckers that is seeing you as their robbery or that's seeing you as competition. It's just giving like, bitch, I already see your goofy ass, but you still want to play these games? Why is the three of cups here? Exactly. You got a group of bitches. Okay? This is a community. It's three bitches. Mama, I told you in the beginning, you are stronger. Hold on. Where is that? Here you go. Right here. You are too strong for these three by three witches. Here they go again. The three by three witches. Not a cups that keeps trying to invite you out with them. They keep trying to invite you and your lover. Actually... Mm. Or they keep coming up with either some type of creativity. I really feel like it's their imagination, though. I'm not even going to kid. Like, I really feel like it's a group of bitches that's literally in their imagination. This is why they're taking these, these, these paths, these choices and shit. But it can also be you got a group of fucking either meddling family members or friends that keep trying to invite y'all out. You and your lover. Six of Wands, because you're being seen in the spotlight. You're getting victory and success. Two of Wands, and it's because of the path that you chose. Wheel of Fortune. The wheel is turning in your favor. You already chose to get victory and success. Like, you already chose to, you know, stand for something or fall for anything. It's giving bitches ain't, ain't thinking. Like, they not. Why is the Six of Pentacles here? Yeah, you had a... Look, here go the same three people here again. This could have been a Taurus. Giving information to two other bitches. Four of Pentacles. Trying to hold you back. Thinking that they had control over a situation. Eight of Pentacles. Whatever work somebody did. Or whatever work that you do. Somebody don't even have. Somebody can't even see what you do. With that two of swords. Eight of Pentacles. I'm also getting. Somebody wants you to give something to them. Okay. This is why they're holding on so tight to you. Eight of Pentacles, it's because of your work. It's because of your mastery. But with this Two of Swords, what they don't see coming, whoever this Queen of Wands is, they're going to be in hella regret because they paid somebody to project on your love life. And they're going to be the ones that's heartbroken because whoever this family is that was doing magic, you're going to be able to heal. And they're going to be rejected for working with each other, trying to block you. Just period. So laugh at them. <laughs> Like, bitches is stupid as fuck. Like, y'all all like, why the fuck is the family working together? Don't you know that's how generation curses, like, play out? Do you know that's how the family get cursed? Yeah, this sound like, this sound like a bunch of stupids. You know, a, a, a bunch of stupids. And that's what we're gonna call them. A bunch of stupids. Like, why would y'all all team up together? What we got going for Scorpio? We got, you are the victor. This action 
It says this action you took is going to be granted. You got a gift coming towards you and it's because you mastered yourself. You was very diligent and you worked on yourself. But you do have a mother figure or a Taurus mother who will be left out in the cold. Didn't we just say something about a, a Taurus? We also have, you have a spiritual bath is needed. A spiritual bath is needed. So get to it. Yeah, you got a beautiful big girl. Let no one discourage you. Yeah, but you got a sneaky link here. That's a booty call that only calls you and it's because they want the goodies. Do not trust them. It says, you chose to move to common waters and now they're burnt. <laughs> Because they linked up to sabotage you because you was given clarity or had clarity about this. Yeah, you could be dealing with a cheater, a liar, a whore that thinks money grows on trees. Like, everybody knows, like, you know, money, you know, possibly, you know, it do come for trees. But, um, bitch, you can't grow a tree, can yeah. yeah. Why is you are the victor? It says this action you took granted you your gift. Because you mastered yourself. Yeah, four of swords. I'm saying that you're being told to rest. Do things with ease. Recharge. And reflect. It's like, take time out and your answers will come to you. Period. Ace of Wands. So you're being told to take time out. But still, take action. You know? <laughs> Three of Wands. Because in the distant horizon page of swords, you're going to have somebody watching you. Hang man reverse. But they already sabotaged their goddamn self. Mm. Why spiritual breath? Is needed. Why is this here? The squirrel. Yeah, eight of cups. Yeah, this is the action you need to take so that you can change. Okay? Because you can have some type of lack of center, some type of dissatisfaction, and this could be from because of a separation. The only thing you need is a, a spiritual bath. Ten of wands to release these burdens. Uh-huh. Three of cups from these op-ass motherfuckers. That's all you need. Uh-huh. Justice. You will be getting your karmic justice, poo. It, ooh, ooh, justice came out in reverse. You got a group of, um, we got three cups here again in reverse. You got a group of disloyal ass bitches who is very biased here. With justice in reverse, that is biased. That's somebody that's biased. That's somebody who makes false ac accusations. This is somebody that is, you know, irresponsible and dishonest. Nine of Pentacles in reverse. This is why they're going through setbacks now. Uh, and it's because they wanted some type of rewards without the work. Three of Pentacles. A group of sloppy ass people who group together to cause conflict. Three of Swords. They're now heartbroken. Seven of Cups because they're realizing that something was just an illusion. Seven of Wands and they're being blocked. Six of Wands reversed and they're about to have a fall from grace. So yeah. Do that spiritual bath, baby. Do that spiritual bath, baby. Mm-hmm. Why is do not trust them? Who do Scorpio... Who should Scorpio not trust? What's this about? Yeah, it's a source. Do not trust them. Ten of Pentacles. This family. Double. Because they're toxic. Come on, so here. You're dealing with a group of... Hmm. That man downstairs, people. The Ten of Pentacles and the devil. Y'all know what that says. This is a demonic-ass family. This is the demonic family. Ace of Swords. That's the truth. Page of Swords. Who's watching you? Three of Wands at a distance. Ace of Wands, take action. Hangman. The hangman's in reverse. <laughs> they are frustrated. Four of Wands, because you are stable. You are secure. <laughs> These are people that's in your motherfucking community. They're being telling, they, they told you not to trust them. At all. Mm-mm. Don't trust them. Don't save her. Don't save them. They don't want to be saved. Why Sneaky Link? Booty call. Only cause when, yeah, whoever this king of swords is, a Gemini, could also be a fucking Pisces. This person is very manipulative, and they create illusions. And they do this because they don't, they, 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 they want to end something with their ex, but they, they're an attention seeker. It's like, it's, they, they, they just, they just an attention seeker. I'm also hearing, excuse me, y'all. You're being told to end something with somebody from your past because they are an attention seeker. They do things for clout. We already got that. A clout chaser. Somebody who do anything for clout. They make it up things, saying anything just to get attention. Why a cheater? Liar? Whore? Why is this here for sport? Why is this here? Yeah. You got a Pisces. 
an Aries, and a Scorpio. You're being told here that um, with the Page of Wands, keep your eye on your goals and enjoy every moment. Because with the moon, you got somebody here that's trying to create an illusion. Okay? And you're being told to believe in your personal power. Because growth always comes from leaving things behind. So if you feel like you need to leave a motherfucker behind, leave him behind. Do not give nobody your fucking power. And do not be caught up in some type of illusion that somebody is trying to paint. Because they are a fucking cheater, a liar, and a whore. And with the page of wands, they're also an attention seeker. They want people to see them. Mm -hmm. Three of swords. And that's the bitter truth. It's just, it's just, it's just simple, y'all. Why is thanks money grows on trees? Why is this here for school? Yeah, with this temperance in reverse, this is somebody who is a conflict of entries. This is somebody who is impatient and stable and just just unstable, bro. Like, just every fucking where. Yeah, the tower. I'm talking about the tower. The star in the reverse. This is somebody who has unfulfilled hopes, disappointed, a fucking past. They have all this doubt. That's why they're in despair. Four cups. And they need to choose their happiness. You're being told to choose happiness. Because somebody is full of doubt, bro. This is why things are not balancing out for them now. It's because they need to choose happiness. With the death card. And the will of fortune. And the hermit. And the three of cups. You ending something was destined. Definitely with this Virgo. And it's because they are disloyal. You're being told to reject this bitch because they betrayed you. Ten of Wands in reverse lied on you and was very malicious and careless at that. Hmm. With the Three of Cups, like I said, you could be dealing with a Cancer. This can definitely be a Cancer's people. They're meddling family members. They're meddling friends. Okay? Mm-hmm. Oh, don't worry. Because, see... You're being told to not trust nobody. And you also was told justice will be served. Like I said, transmute that bullshit. Because somebody just wants you to... Hmm. Say like you dealing with in-laws. And they used to fucking with, you know, their brothers, girls and shit. Or their, their, this is brothers. They, they're used to trying to bully their sisters, you know, boyfriends. These are bitches who want you to conform to that and be cool with that. <laughs> These motherfuckers don't know what they just got themselves into. Mm -mm -mm. Yup, we got a hood pharmacist here. Yeah, this motherfucker a dream thief. They want to talk you out your dreams. But also, with this hood pharmacist, make sure it ain't you. Because you could be smoking weed and, you know, your mind, you know, that weed sometimes the hell you think of some shit that ain't there, you know? You got somebody that want to call you, but they can't because they're blocked. No more obstacles is in your way. Definitely when it comes to this snake, two-faced dicks, bitch. Their name could start with a P, Q, R, or S. Be very cautious when it comes to this P, Q, R, S person. And like I said, it's because they want you to conform to their family beliefs, to their family traditions, higher things. That is traditional beliefs. A, B, C, or D. This is an envious sister or brother. That's clout hungry, using your name and pictures for attention. They really need help. And you're, again, like I said, you're being told to transmute that bullshit. And it's because this is somebody who takes advantage of the weak. And oh, this is a sick motherfucker. This person ain't gonna start with a W, X, Y, or Z. This is somebody who wants to guilt trip you. They was the main one though. Yeah, you're being seen as an earth angel. And you need to focus on, you need to focus on the positive. Because somebody is sending you projections to fuck with your mind. So think positive. This person ain't gonna start with a T, U, or V. So that's all that I have, Scorpio. If the message resonates, make sure you like, share, subscribe. All right?